Hey guys, my name is Susie from Nature Tech and I'm here to answer your question about Wally32. You always ask us, what are the differences between the round NFT channel, you know, and this square channel we use at Wally32. So actually there are three main differences. The first one is the method. The method of the round rectangle, it doesn't matter really the shape, but the first method is the NFT, nutrient film technique. In nutrient film technique, there is a thin layer of nutrient solution that is running through the channel to the reservoir and back to the channels and it goes like that again and again and again 24 7. Here it's a shallow water culture SWC it means that it has a shallow level of nutrient solution that is running through the system to the reservoir and goes again and again and again so what are the differences? The differences are that in NFT if the pump has failed for any reason. If there is no electricity right now, we don't know why, but we don't have it, then we have few hours. We have very short time to respond to that. Our plants doesn't have any water, okay? They will dry out very fast, especially with this kind of sun. In the shallow water culture, no. There is a shallow water inside. Water with nutrient solution and oxygen, the plants keep on defeating, they are thriving. This system, for example, is working on solar panel only. Okay, it's only on solar panel, low battery, no electricity. When there is a sun, it works. When the sun goes down, it turns down. But the plants are happy, they're thriving, nothing is missing. It also means that you can put on timer. If you don't want it to work at night, if you want to do it some special arrangement, you can, okay? That is number one. So the second difference is the fact that you can access the roots. And what do I mean? I'll show you right now. You see those roots? Those beautiful roots? When you grow in Wally big plants, and you can grow in Wally big plants, you don't need to plant only lettuce and herbs and that in, on summer times, like what is going to happen right now, tomorrow replacing the plants. You can plant here tomatoes and cucumbers and melons and watermelons and peppers and eggplants and what's not, okay? And when you grow big plants and when you grow them for a long time, sometimes the plants grow big as well and they clog uh, the system. They clog and the water are rising up and then start leaking. It happens in NFT, in SWC, in whatever method there is. Drip. If the, the root system is growing big, we're having a small type of problem. Here, we will only lift the cover, we will trim the roots, like in the guide we've put on our website of how to trim hydroponic roots, and we'll put it back, and that's it, easy. In NFT system, where it's closed channel, we'll have to aggressively take the plant out, we will probably hurt its roots, and we will probably also leave the organic roots with, with uh, uh, when we tear it down, we, we've left inside, they will probably be rotten, the, probably pathogens and bacteria and diseases and you know it goes on and on it's not healthy to do it like that this is the healthy way so the third thing the third difference is the fact that we have accessibility not only to the roots but to the inside of the channel and for us it's a big difference because when we finish when we finish to grow when we finish a season when we finish a planting cycle we want to replace it with a new one but the new one needs to be planted in a very, very clean and sterilized hydroponic system, okay? If you will plant your new plants in a, a system that, in channels that are not clean, you will have problems along the way. You will find it up. So here you can take off the cover, you can clean inside, you can desterilize it with bleach, with hydrogen peroxide, do it in any way you find comfortable and run the water inside and replant you know it's easy it's very comfortable it's very fast and that's how we like to do it when people are growing in closed channels they have to fight with the channel they have to get inside from the openings on top of the channel they usually uh, use uh, toilet brushes and they get creative and and they get cuts on their hands we don't want that we don't want hard life we want easy life so here the cover is removable you can access inside the channel and make sure it's clean for your next site so if you have any more questions we are here for you and i really wish successful hydrophonic growing and we'll see you again soon, soon. bye, -bye.